How's it going guys, Sharblox here. Welcome to my third video on the Roblox Tommy Hilfiger event. And in today's video guys, we are going to be getting 13 prizes. Yeah, something like that. There's quite a few to get. So this is the first one, the TJ Chicago Cropped Windbreaker. It's lead clothing. It's kind of like a jacket, which is like cut in half. It's for like girls really, isn't it? But yeah, I guess it's not too bad. I'll show you guys how to get this as well. We are also going to be getting various free accessories. We can definitely get these two for free. The BMX bike and the cap, we already got that earlier. But yeah, these two caps we can also get. And we can also get loads of random clothing. Lead clothing, 2D clothing, shirts, pants, t-shirts, hoodies and sweaters. Yeah, loads of random stuff, guys. So let's join the events game and yeah, let's get everything. Once you guys join the game, go ahead and hold your spacebar to skip the intro. And yeah, let's start off by getting that cropped hoodie thing. What was it called again? Tommy Hilfiger cropped sweater or something? I don't know. But basically, guys guys, to get this, you have to be third on one of the leaderboards. So basically, you click on server rights. And if you're in the top three for races one on the server, then yeah, you will actually get that hoodie thing. I think you can also get this by playing mini games. But yes, that's how you go about getting it anyway. And if you guys are wondering, well, how do you do races? You basically go over to one of them. So as you can see, BMX race. There's another BMX race over there. There's like portals all around the map. And all you really need to do is basically stand on one of them. Press Q to go ahead and jump on your BMX. And yeah, you basically wait for the race to start. And then you literally just go around the track. You can also get coins if you want to. Do like speed boosts and stuff like that. It's kind of like Mario Kart, I guess. But with BMX bikes instead. And yeah, that's basically it. If you join a small server and you're in the top three of races one. Well, yeah, you get that lead clothing hoodie thing. Not like anyone cares about it anyway, I guess. And if you guys are wondering about all of the other stuff. Well, you actually get these from the shop. So if you guys click on the gear icon down at the left hand Hand side. And if you click on all, you can actually see you can literally buy this stuff for in-game tokens. All of this stuff can also be purchased for Robux. However, I wouldn't really recommend spending Robux on this stuff. I don't know, that just kind of seems like a waste of money. If you guys just play like random races, so if you click on play down here, it comes up with these like mini games, I guess you could call them. And there's a hydrant thing, there's a race, there's a trick park. Let's go to the trick park first so I can show you guys what I mean. If you press Q to go ahead and access your BMX bike, you see these like mini tokens which are kind of just like floating about well yeah you can basically go ahead and collect these you can also get them in races and that's all you really need to do it doesn't take too long to collect like a good few hundred of them i would probably recommend playing races though that's probably like how you get the most so as you guys can see i now have a few and if i go ahead and open up the gear menu again or the shop i should actually be able to buy some stuff like some accessories you can buy other stuff as well and you can also go on rewards if you want to complete daily challenges and stuff like like that. And the next one's in six hours, so I'm definitely not going to get that. Let's go back to the shop, though. Let's try and buy something. Where was it? There you go. Gear. So if I go on clothing, I have 311. So that means, guys, I can actually buy the sports cap. So let's go and buy it. There you go. We got a free accessory. And yeah, there's like 12 items here in total. 13 in this video, including that cropped um, windbreaker, whatever it was called. And yeah, I guess that's pretty much it. So that's pretty much it for this video, guys. And that's how you get the final 13 accessories. If they decide to add any more, I would definitely make an update video. But yeah, anyway, if you guys enjoyed this one, as always, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one.